So we do have some changing factors, right? And, and perhaps uh, earnings expectations for growth were a little bit high. But Mr. President, please, Mr. President, get off, find a new topic other than the Fed. Leave Jay Powell alone. This did not end well for Richard Nixon or Arthur Burns, okay, when, when that's been tried before. The Fed is doing exactly what the Fed said they were going to do at their end report of 2016, when Janet Yellen was head of the Fed and when uh, Donald Trump was not the president. They are on target. In fact, they, they uh, might even be behind because GDP is a full well, point well, and a half. Well, the question is, has, has, the, has, has, the, has the data changed? Trump, right. Has <laughs> the data changed, though, in the meantime? Not the not Fed is doing exactly what it should be. I think, I think what you really is have to look at is, is in... It, as it relates to the Fed, you have to look at whether the rise in interest rates is affecting the rest of the credit market. Now, credit is starting to worsen just a little bit, but it's because equities are making the weakness in equi the equity market is making it do that. Now, earlier we're talking about a tradable bounce. I, I'm terrible trader. I think from an inter from an investment standpoint, these Washington shenanigans cause weakness that ultimately should provide opportunity as long as credit's okay. But really quickly, I, I, high yield is at two-year lows. Let's be clear. Credit is, is moving, but and I think the sensitive, okay, but there is sensitivity the revolving are debt. A cycle but you're going to tell me that the household doesn't feel some pressure from the move in LIBOR on their credit card and their home equity and, and their student loans? I think they do. Yeah. Last Let me just make a last point that when we're hearing some of these companies that people are disappointed in their earnings, they're not saying the Fed is making it difficult for us. They're saying they're tariff issues, right? Right. That's Trump's policy. So, you know, for him to talk about the Fed. But should the Fed to... continue raising rates, even if the companies, they don't, they don't say their problems are because of the Fed, but they say that they're seeing less demand. The Fed's yeah, apolitical. The Fed, costs the Fed or whatever should continue else the on this plan. Is. They can't fine tune yes, this plan of exactly. this ending this grand experiment. This is an no independent way. central bank. Well, and, and, and the bottom line here is uh, what we're hearing from the Fed is that they're going to move along their own and path. It needs